Welcome back to my channel. So today I have another cleaning video for you guys. So this is what my house looked like on this day. It was just so messy. There was stuff everywhere. You'll also notice in a few clips that the hallway looks absolutely trash. As some of you know, we've been redoing my son's bedroom. So we were kind of going through boxes because we only moved into this house a couple months ago. So there's just stuff everywhere. Oh, you can see the boxes right there. I'm not going to be tackling those boxes in this video. My husband was actually working on that while I was doing all of this mess. But there was a lot to do, so I wanted to film it for you guys. Now today's video is a little extra special because it's a collab with one of my friends here on YouTube, Hannah from Hannah's Happy Home. Now if you don't know who Hannah is, she is a wife, she is a mom to two sweet, cute little boys. Oh, they're just so precious. Her home is absolutely gorgeous and she does videos about home, cleaning, lifestyle, she does vlogs. I always enjoy all of her videos that I watch and I know you will too. So I'm gonna have her link down below in the description and make sure you go ahead and check her out whenever you're done watching this video. Let her know that I sent you. And let's just get on into the cleaning. Now if you guys are a long time subscriber, you might notice that those shelves are new. I actually made those shelves and I have a video coming soon showing you guys how you can make them. They were super easy and really cheap. I just got a bunch of stuff at Home Depot and it was fun and they're like really personalized. I like them. I'm really proud of them. So I'll definitely have a video about those soon. And in this little spot right here, currently I have all his toys as you'll see in a second, but I bought a dresser from um, Facebook Marketplace for only 40 bucks and I'm gonna paint it with chalk paint and I have like all these plans and it fits perfectly in that space so it's kind of long and I'm gonna put a lamp on it and then it has a lot of drawers that I'm gonna put his toys in and I think it's gonna be super cute so I can't wait to show you guys that and then of course I get my diffuser going I think on this day I was diffusing gentle baby tangerine orange and lavender and bergamot and it smelled so good. I do get a lot of questions about that diffuser, by the way. I always have the link down in the description if you are interested in getting an essential oil starter kit, and the diffuser comes with that. So I had this table runner for like two days, and I actually decided to return it. I wasn't in love with it. I can't figure out what kind of table runner I want there. If you guys have any suggestions, leave them down below. This is the third table runner that I've returned now. And if you haven't already, I would absolutely love for you to subscribe to see more cleaning videos, vlogs, what I eat in a days, decor videos, DIYs. I have all of that coming soon, so I would absolutely love for you to, to subscribe if you want to. Now, if you've also been watching my videos for a while, you'll notice I switched out the curtains. So those curtains used to be white and they were kind of short and I actually got longer curtains and I got them in tan and I am loving them. I feel like it looks so much classier and like kind of regal. Tell me what you guys think. I'm loving it. I just think it looks so nice. Like it looks more expensive. I don't know. I feel fancy with them.
Now it's time for my absolute least favorite part. I hate doing the dishes. Let me know in the comments what your least favorite part is. I will put off doing the dishes until I absolutely have to. Thankfully my husband's a really big help and he doesn't mind doing the dishes, but they just gross me out. I would rather do anything else. I would rather do 20 piles of laundry than do the dishes. And also, like I said, that pile behind me in that hallway, that was because we were going through all the boxes that we hadn't unpacked yet. So my husband was going through those as I was cleaning. I promise it doesn't normally look like that. Now this video is not sponsored, but I did want to give Grove Collaborative a little shout out because they were kind enough to send me this hand soap dispenser and dish soap dispenser and I just think they're so beautiful so I wanted to say thank you Grove I thought that was very kind of them and I do have a link in my description if you are interested no pressure <laughs> but you can get that hand soap dispenser as well as that huge refill bag and like a super pretty white tray I have a link in my description to get that for free with a $20 purchase from Grove and if you don't know Grove is where I get like most of my cleaning products from Okay guys, this is a little bit of a hot mess process. I have never cleaned a stove top like this before. Like I said, we moved into this house recently and I've always had those like flat, like glass stove tops. So I'm a little new to this. Leave me a comment if you're used to cleaning these and let me know how you clean your stove top, like your gas stove top. Is that what this is called? I, I honestly don't even know. Um, I didn't really know what I was doing. I mean, I was using my Thieves Cleaner from my Young Living, like my essential oil cleaner, and then I tried using the Mrs. Meyer stuff, and everything worked great. It just felt like a really long process, and it didn't feel like it got fully clean, so I would love some su suggestions below if you have any. But that is it guys, thank you so much for watching. It really means the world to me. If you enjoyed, I would love to get a thumbs up from you and possibly subscribe. And make sure you check out Hannah's channel. I'm gonna have her linked down below. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all have a great day. You're the